I told you, I told you that Nyeson Wiki will finally defect to the All Progressive Congress. Yes. 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 That the presumed yes. reconciliation yes. of Wiki, the former governor of River State, and Sim Fobara, the current governor of River State, was a screen saver. Hello everyone, welcome once again to Think Tank TV. Now it's obvious that the political landscape in River State is undergoing a major transformation as 27 of Wiki loyalists. The assembly members have just defected to the All Progressives Congress. What are they up to? Will it be safe to say that Wiki is cooking up something for Sim Fubara? For those who may have forgotten, recall that Nyeso Wiki castigated David Umahi, the former governor of Ebonyi State and the current minister of works, when he moved to the All Progressives Congress. In fact, Wiki was the one who championed the legal process against him for leaving the party. I castigating him that he had no moral know. right to move to another political party after a political party had given him victory. Today, his loyalists, the 27 members of the House of Assembly, has moved to the All Progressive Congress. Anyway, let's take a look at the constitutional provision of the law. The constitution provides that before a party man can defect to another political party, there must be an internal wrangling in the party. No wonder. Their reasons for defecting to the All Progressives Congress was that the position of the National Secretary of the PDP is highly contested. Now let's hear from members of the House of Assembly who made their points and gave their reasons for defecting to the All Progressives Congress. Don't go anywhere, I'll be coming back to wrap up the video. My name is Moses and this is Think Tank TV. I've read the letter in this house. It's the duty of this house to find out whether the conditions upon which the defection is made is sufficient for him to actually defect from the People's Democratic Party to the APC. Distinguished colleagues, the section of the Constitution has made it clear the condition upon which a member can defect, which is a division in his political party where he was elected into the House of Assembly. And from the evidence that is before us, it is clear that there is division in the PDP. Because as it stands today, it is difficult for people to even know who the National Secretary of the Party is. And of course, the office of the Secretary, the National Secretary of the Party is key. It's by voter to the functioning of that party. There are now factions, some people are supporting the uh, some alliance, while others are not. And this clear division has warranted the decision of right to the Mao to defect to the um, All Progressive Congress. On that note, distinguished colleagues, do we have any objection or do we have any reason? Do we think it is insufficient or the reasons he has uh, so preferred are insufficient for him to defect? Our members, is, I, I, I bring it open to the House. Do we have any objection to this? Okay, hold on. You have seen it for yourself. Now it's obvious that Nyeson Wike has succeeded in hijacking the All Progressive Congress River State from Amiechi. For those of you who are thinking that these guys are there to protect the interests of the citizens, you have seen it for yourself that they are there for their selfish interests. Now, do you think that Fobara has the political cloud to muzzle up the position of the River State Governor and fight Wiki to a standstill? Please do want to go to the comment section. Let's get to know what your thinking is as we shall continually be here to serve you. Thank you so much to all our viewers and returning subscribers. We do not take it lightly. My name again is Moses and this is Think Tank TV. See you on our next video. Bye for now.